Um, I'm Brianna Lee Rodriguez. Um, I'm actually Al's assistant in the student life office, so we kind of, I just help Al <laughs> out. <laughs> so one of the largest changes we're gonna have is that um, a lot of a lot of things are gonna integrate onto the app. I don't know if you guys have heard about the mobile app, the Lee Rich Maui mobile app. So. Um, kids or students can come into the lounge and they'll have to check in with a QR code that we have like in the lounge so they can check in with the QR code on the app and they'll go to also like a form that they'll fill out for contact tracing purposes as well so as far as the form goes they can fill out the form but it won't tell like the exact time that the student came into the lounge so that with the QR code check-in it'll be like okay they came into the lounge at 10 o'clock so if someone was infected or whatever the case may be, came in at 10.30, then we don't have to worry about contacting that student who came at 10, even though they were in the lounge. So it's kind of like killing two birds with one stone, but we're doing it all through the app. Um, so we're allowing, I think it was nine students in lounge at a time, and it's all social distancing, six feet apart, mask required and all of that. And we're also taking temperatures. Anyone who comes in needs to have their um, temperature taken. So. Lots of changes, but at the same time, once all of that is over, so it's just the beginning, they can go in and they can proceed as normal. So it's kind of nice. As far as I know right now, we have, um, through the app, of course, we're actually helping with FYE. It's not really through Student Life, but we're helping with first year students through the app on our side because we do app management through the Student Life um, program and so we're helping with first year students to get in through the app and we're kind of integrating IDs we're gonna try and put the IDs on the app so that they don't have to personally come in get their picture taken or whatever the case may be so that's one thing so students like I said earlier they have to get their temperature taken and it has to be a normal reading of course for them to enter the lounge and they have to be wearing a mask um, if they have any like runny nose, cough, whatever the case may be, they're, we're asking them to, you know, sorry, but you have to go home and whatever, just precautionary. And we are doing the contact tracing stuff as well through the app. So yeah, that's about it. <laughs> So the best way to contact us is definitely through our email at uhmslife at hawaii.edu. That's um, number one. We're always checking our emails even when we're at home. Me and Al both um, access the email while we're at home. Just checking if students need anything. Another good way is through our phone, which is 808-984-3434. Um, so whenever I'm in office, which is usually like 8.30 to 12 daily, or Monday through Friday, I, I'll answer their calls, whatever they need, I'll be there to help, so yeah.